end the pandemic is, of course, if people take it, if they get vaccinated. And the incoming administration says it is going to work to promote confidence in the safety of the shot. Are you confident that if and when the FDA does give that approval, it will be safe and effective? And will you take it? Of course I will. Do you plan to get vaccinated before Inauguration Day? And will you do it in public the way that Presidents Obama, Bush and Clinton have suggested they're willing? I'd be happy to do that. Once it's declared to be safe, and then I think what Barack said, once Fauci says it's clear, that's, that's my measure, then obviously we take it. And it's important to communicate to the American people, it's safe. It's safe to do this. So in agreeing to take this vaccine publicly, the president-elect and others are taking a page out of the book of Elvis Presley, because back in 1956, he took a polio vaccine backstage at the Ed Sullivan Show to encourage teenagers to get vaccinated. Does it work, Dr. G, having a celebrity or a president in this case taking a vaccine in front of the public? When Elvis Presley took the polio vaccine on the Ed Sullivan Show, people lined up for the polio vaccine like it was the newest iPhone. They were happy to do it. They were happy to wait and they were inspired. We need inspirational leaders to help us build trust. And every one of us is inspired in different ways, right? Some of us by our religious leaders, some of us by our family, some of us have celebrity crushes, Matthew McConaughey is mine, Brianna, I know you've got one too. Um, so let's all lean in and let's ask our celebrity partners, our community leaders to help us build that community trust. But let's also not forget the local ce celebrity you should be leaning on right now, which is your local doctor. Call your doctor, set up a video visit, don't leave your home, and start that conversation about why you are perhaps debating the vaccine, debating where and when and how you can get it. Start that conversation right now with your doc. Human behavior is impossible to change. It takes time. Starting the drumbeat now, relying on trusted partners in the community. Minority communities like to hear from minorities right? We want to make sure that everyone feels like, one, they have someone to aspire to, to look to, and we want to make sure that we are also relying on our physicians. Our new Surgeon General is going to be an excellent example, Dr. Fauci another, but let's not forget that local physicians know their local patients, their local community, and now with the beauty of technology, we have the opportunity to have those conversations at any time online, with or without insurance. So it is very important. PR, science needs a PR campaign. That is the piece that needs to be done in parallel with this vaccine.